Hi, I'm Matt. I'm part of the AFC production team and I'm here to show you unboxing the AFC and setting it up. So firstly, getting the AFC out of the box, we have the AFC. Uh, in the box we have the quick start guide and the AFC manual. Uh, important material if you want to read through um, setting up the AFC. We have the AFC column mounts. Um, these are for the QEVs. We have four different types, singles, originals, twos and tens, and we have a, a reservoir for the original column. We have the wall charger with the tube adapters. These go in this box, as well as the power, power cable for the AFC. We have a consumables box, which contains uh, centrifuge tubes in the size of five mils and two mils, as well as a spare nozzle kit for uh, the AFC, as well as we also supply a 10 gram weight. We have a shield that protects the AFC when samples are running. We have the carousel with the two mil centrifuge side and the five mil centrifuge side, um, and the carousel plate, which goes on top of the AFC. There is an indent on top of the AFC and a protrusion on the bottom of the, the carousel plate, which it slides into and connects up to. Once that's ready, there's another, there's indents on here with another protrusion on top here. And you just connect it up and that's the carousel all set up. And what you want to do is connect up the AFC to power and turn the AFC on. The AFC will then turn on, showing the initializing screen, rotate to go back to zero position. And now we have the home screen menu. To set up the AFC, we go into the setup menu by pressing setup. We can click on the carousel. And what we want to do when we calibrate, we have four options uh, to go clockwise or anti-clockwise. And what we want to do is line up the um, AFC so that the void uh, flush hole is in line with the tube adapter. So once we are happy with where zero is, we set zero. We can then customize our lighting, so we can either have the lighting on or off, just by pushing the button. To calibrate the scale, we can go into the scale function, push calibrate. Uh, you can easily follow the steps on the screen. It is telling us to uh, put nothing on the AFC. We can grab the carousel shield, placing that over top. Pressing OK, and wait a couple of seconds for it to initialize. Once that's done, we we'll take the shield off. We grab the 10 gram weight supplied in the package, put it anywhere in the carousel, and we're able to put that shield back on. Once that's OK, you can press OK. I'll wait a couple of seconds, and the AFC shall calibrate. To begin a run, we first need to select our QEV column and sample of choice. We can then insert our appropriate column mount and column for the process. I'll be using a QEV original. By pressing on the collection schedule, it allows us to customize what volumes we want to put through our AFC. There are three categories you can modify. The count of centrifuge tubes that we want to use, the volume going to each tube, and the buffer volume that will be dispensed into the middle before the collection of the samples. To start the run, we can press start collection. This will then take us through a series of screens to confirm that we're collecting the correct schedule. The next step will ask you whether you would like to flush the column. We recommend flushing all of our columns with a fresh filtered PBS buffer. While the AFC is in flushing or priming mode, the carousel will be in flush position and the buffer will flow out from the column through the flush hole into the carousel. This will then be pumped out through the waste tube. The next screen will prompt the user to put the carousel cover on the AFC, which I have already done. The cover protects the carousel from being inadvertently bumped during operation. Make sure there's sufficient buffer volume available and press OK. Uh, ensure there is no residual buffer on the top of the column before loading the sample. Load the sample and press OK. The 
the column will start running and the buffer volume will start collecting. Once the sample is entered the upper fret of the column, top up the buffer volume and resume collection. The AFC will finish by collecting the buffer volume followed by the fractions.